working as, as family does have its challenges. Of course it does. Everybody here, the fact that everyone's laughing means that everybody <laughs> knows exactly what it's like. Um, but, um, look, you know, we're, we're, we're stuck together for the rest of our lives, so... <laughs> This is true. Togetherness at its <laughs> Togetherness. finest. Togetherness, yeah, yeah. That was the Fab Four speaking at the first Royal Foundation Forum in February 2018. But now we're learning there's nothing together about them anymore. Working together as family, do you ever have disagreements about things? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Healthy, healthy disagreement. Okay. On Thursday, Kensington Palace released a statement announcing that Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are officially splitting from Prince William and Kate Middleton's charity. The news comes one day after a source told ET that the split was expected to become official this week. The last thing you disagreed on, how do you resolve it? Uh, I can't remember. They come so freaking fast. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. but it's, but it's, is it resolved? We don't know. I hope we don't know. Per the statement, the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge are the winners of this theoretical custody battle. The Royal Foundation will become their principal charitable and philanthropic vehicle later this year, while the Duke and Duchess of Sussex will establish their own new charitable foundation with transitional operating support from the Royal Foundation. But this isn't totally good. Goodbye. So you both take credit for coming up with the idea? Totally. <laughs> According to the palace statement, both couples will continue to work together on projects in the future. This includes the foundation's mental health program, Heads Together. Why Heads Together and why mental health? It's your idea. It? It's your idea. It's a common thread, wasn't it? Mental health sort of seemed to run between all the different areas that we were working in. According to the palace, these changes are designed to best complement the work and responsibilities of their royal highnesses as they prepare for their future roles and to better align their charitable activity with their new households. Adding that both couples are incredibly proud of what they've achieved together through the royal foundation. I found uniting people together and bringing them together made so much it broke down barriers it made things move much quicker much smoother and actually we got more impact from that as for what the future of the foundation holds will and kate plan to build on the foundation's past successes which means focusing on initiatives like heads together united for wildlife and mentally healthy schools they're also in the process of developing new initiatives on the environment and support for children and families. Expect updates on those in the coming year. A source told ET on Wednesday that the split among the royals and individual charities was expected, adding that there are ongoing discussions about disentangling the finances. I think it surprised all of us how much it, it took off. The Royal Foundation was set up by William, Kate and Harry in 2011, with Meghan making her first appearance at the forum in 2018. She officially joined the organization last June, following her wedding to Prince Harry. I think it, it, it's absolutely the case that the brothers did fall out. I was told by a very senior royal source that actually they weren't talking to each other at one point. Of course, the split has once again sparked the debate about a rift between between the two couples. But royal expert Katie Nichol tells ET that the Cambridges and the Sussexes actually seem to be getting along better these days. I certainly think now that Archie is here, um, it has probably really helped to improve the relationship. William is over the moon that his brother is, is a dad. Kate is very broody. She loves to be around newborns. And I hear that Kate has made herself available to Meghan if, if she needs advice, if she needs any help.